Well, I think two ways. For my organization, one, I remind our employees and partners what they're doing. So one, we are helping companies reach their goal by supplying them with their human capital, their most important asset. And two, we are placing people that obviously we're having a huge impact on their lives, we're having a huge impact on the economy. So that's one. Two, with our internal employees, part of my job and how I inspire them is I want to know what their goals are, what drives them, what inspires them, and I constantly try to help them achieve their goals and maximize their potential. I think a couple things. One, I think a great leader has to be transparent. A great leader has to create a clear vision for the organization. And a great leader has to delegate and empower its people to help the organization achieve that vision. Work-life balance. That's a funny question. I'm not sure I know what that is. Um, seriously, when you are running a small business, work-life balance, it's like being a parent. You, you never, you're always a parent. You might get away from it, you might have a night out in the town, but you're still talking about your kids, you're still worried about your kids. That's work-life balance for a, for a, a small business. Uh, a small business owner. You're always thinking about it, you're always talking about it, it's always on your mind. So I try the best as I, as I can, but I don't know if there's really a such thing. If there is, I haven't found it yet.